What up, family? Cost you nothing to hit that like button, fam. Birdman. If you don't know when it come to this hot boy reunion, you know, Lil Wayne, he came in late. Lil Wayne didn't affiliate it, didn't affiliate like he should with them throughout this process. He also made it well known that he was there on behalf of Young Money fam. Not no hot boy, none of that. And it was shocking for the fans to see because we was all expecting, you know, them to do a set together. Everybody came in doing their own set. And mind you, like I'm saying, Lil Wayne waited late to come in um, and do his set and he didn't mingle around like one would think by this being a reunion, BG being out, individuals um, coming together. But Wayne was in Wayne's world. Now, we all know that Birdman and Lil Wayne relationships been rocky for a minute now. Reasons why this relationship been rocky, fam, because it's been millions of dollars into play. You done had artists like Drake and Nicki Minaj come through that umbrella and they accumulated a lot of money that caused a lot of frustration between cash money and young money when it comes to who's supposed to be getting what, right? I think Wayne into his realization now that he really his own boss and he don't want to be the son no more, pretty much. Now, fast forward after doing this, it didn't sit right with Birdman. And at the end of Essence Festival, Birdman say he would never do, you know, he for his city of New Orleans and he would never do no pussy, excuse my language, ass shit. You know what I'm saying? He for his city, New Orleans, and, and he gonna be there for him. And the Essence Festival was in New Orleans and he was saying that to Lil Wayne as far as Lil Wayne not supporting what they had going on and not being there. So he would never do, you know, no pussy ass shit like that. He for, you know, uh, New Orleans. Now, I must say that I thought that this situation was going to be cool because Wayne spoke on it. You know, in the interview said he was all for it, you know, and we know the back and forth with Turk, BG, and with Bert, all these different things, but we even thought that Turk was going to uh, be in the play. A lot of people saying reasons Wayne didn't do what he do because Turk wasn't in the play and it wasn't a fully hot boy uh, reunion without that. It's been a lot of different speculations on what was the core reasons about these situations. And we got to look at reality now. And reality, the reality is Birdman and Lil Wayne. Lil Wayne come up on the Birdman umbrella since a young kid, right? And once Wayne got to popping off and learning things in the hip hop game, he started learning the business side of it and got to noticing that I supposed to be getting way more than what I'm getting. He also figured out that he shouldn't have did the young money cash money deal. He should have just did the young money deal on his own with a universal or whatever the case distribution. It shouldn't have been a cash money because that kept Birdman umbrella shadowing Wayne Tannis. Drake and what he had going on. And these dudes came into the game like Drake, if you notice. Did none of this come about when it come to Lil Wayne and Birdman until Drake and Nicki popped off on that label? They didn't expect Drake to go. The world didn't expect Drake to go like, like it did. And once it happened like that, it's so many million dollars come into play from so many different ways. Drake was doing, uh, it was a lot of different stuff. Drake and Nicki was doing other deals, different endorsements, stuff like that. And it caused a money run to what people like, well, I'm supposed to be getting this. I should be doing this. I did this. Also, Jay Prince, Jazz Prince, brung um, Drake to the game. So it was like a three, four man. It, it was a lot of money going different ways when it come to Drake, especially. And that what caused the 50 me all these different monies that Wayne got from 
Birdman, Cash Money, that's what it was. Because it was a big spur. Like, Drake now wasn't playing with numbers, fam. Still not. Nicki not playing when it comes to numbers, fam. You know, still not. I think that, and Birdman have spoke out. I don't, I don't know how this situation going to get. I hope it don't boil over like it did the last time. But Birdman have spoke out and saying he was learning the game as he was going. But at this time that Birdman was going, when Nicki and Drake came into the game, Birdman had been in the game long enough to know what the deal was. And I felt like Wayne, and I know Wayne felt like that he was getting played because he stepped back from everything. This Essence Festival was so backwards in New Orleans. New Orleans don't even sound like the place to even be doing when it comes to festivals and stuff like that. I mean, I understand Florida might have could have done something different in a, in a different place. But New Orleans, even Buster Ryan was in there like, hey, man, you know, y'all got to get it. Y'all got to respect us. Get off your phone. Like, we come here to, you know what I'm saying? We've been doing this 30 years. And individuals act like we ain't even heard out on their phone. Buster Ryan was even going off. So it was a crazy night all the way around that night. When Wayne came out, I seen it in Wayne's face that he didn't even want to be there. Period. He didn't He didn't want to be there. And even before this went down, I felt like it was going to be like it was because it was too much surrounded around it. It wasn't built off love. It was built off what the fans want. It's cool the fans to want a reunion, but if it ain't there, I mean, everybody should have just, I feel like Birdman could have brought everybody together, talked about it. How you feel about this? Everybody face to face. Individuals like a BG and all the rest of even Turk, they behind the computer board talking about how they feel and about each other. Ain't nobody talking as a man. Fans was like, hey, it is not a reunion without Turk. Birdman saying Turk got to stay over there. BG even was at the festival before he went on to perform backstage. Fans is asking him, about Turk not being there and BG saying Turk done some whole shit. Excuse my language. And then one would think like, hey, with all this going on right there, you should be focused on doing your performance. You know, whatever that you got. Go I mean, just leave it alone. It's in the I Ain't nobody tried to shoot or kill nobody, hurt nobody. People got to understand that people is human. It's going to be more people making mistakes. If your son made the mistake, your mother made the mistake, you'll still be rocking with them, though. Right? So it's the same difference when it comes to an individual that you really was calling your brother. You know what I'm saying? It shouldn't be nothing. If an individual ain't hurt you, your kids tried to kill you, and nothing, it should be nothing to where you would look at that individual like they're a dead person to you after all the real talking things that y'all have did together. Even when it come to Birdman and Wayne, like I, it's just crazy, man, what come with this game when individuals start to get the money. But I will keep y'all updated on situations, family. But make sure you hit that like button and make sure you hit that subscribe button. I'm out.